Within the game The Forest, one of the lesser attainable weapons is the Flintlock Pistol. The Flintlock Pistol is a one-shot weapon and so must regularly be reloaded after each shot, taking about 3-4 to four seconds in total to do so. This weapon can be found deconstructed around the map in various locations. Eight pistol parts can be found in total and when constructed give you as the player a distance and damage multiplier over other weapons, aiding you in your attempts to survive the horrors of the peninsula. So in today's video I'll be explaining and showing you guys all the locations uh, where you can find the pieces needed for its construction and how to access them. Many various gun parts are located under light grey coloured rock mounds around various locations on the map of the forest. These mounds need to be removed before you can actually get to that specific part. In order to do so you have to use explosives either TNT sticks or a crafted explosive which includes uh, the bombs, sticky bombs, head bombs and explosive wire traps. It's important to note that a molotov will uh, not work, however luring a Virginian or an Armsy to the area and having them attack the mound will strangely work. When you blow up these rock mounds, aside from just receiving the part, there is a chance you'll also be rewarded with some other items like gun ammo, rope, a watch and a skull. Once you discover all the pistol pieces and the flintlock has been crafted, the parts will automatically respawn in their respective locations. This means after you have crafted one, a friend that joins your server can also craft their own, or you can give them yours and you can go make another gun for yourself. However, you cannot hold two of the flintlocks at the same time. Gun part one, or the barrel of the gun, is a short distance from the main cannibal village. It is south of the location located nearby the cliff edge closest by the coast. Gun part 3 is the ramrod and it can be found inside one of the huts of the lakeside village. Gun part 2, or the stock, is located at the end of the large peninsula, behind the sacred tree situated on a large cliff, right in line with the coast and is probably the easiest one to find. Gun part 5, basically the part 1, of the trigger mechanism. It can be found a short distance from the edge of a cliff that goes down to Gee's Lake. Gun part 6 is the spring and the second part of the trigger mechanism. It can be discovered if you travel to the southernmost of the two islands near the shipping containers along the peninsula's coastline. Be aware that while swimming to the island, the water is shark infested, so it is probably best to construct a boat before taking the journey. Gun part 4 is the cock and it is located by the beach hut village, more specifically if you can find uh, the dead sharks near the shoreline where the river meets the ocean that means you're very close. Gun part 8 is the jaw or otherwise known as the hammer and can be found towards the top end of the map, 
near the beach hut, but further north from its location, depicted on the map, near the cliff's edges. Gun Part 7 is the Flint of the Flintlock Pistol, and it can be located close by the Snow Lake and the mountain area grave in the snowy mountainous areas of the map. So that's all the pistol parts and locations around the peninsula. And now, once you go into your inventory um, and craft the flintlock, you have a weapon to use against the many threats that lay in wait around the peninsula. But what other videos would you guys like to see? If you have any ideas or have any questions you would like answered, please meet me down in the comments. If you did enjoy the video, please leave a like and go check out Law and Explained on Twitter and Discord. If you would like to support myself and the channel's content, as well as get access to behind the scenes and early content, as well as other awards, you can become a channel member. I hope you guys did enjoy the video and I'll talk to you guys in the next one.